What is Channel Mixer in Photoshop for? Let's get into this video and I'm gonna show you how you can use it to your photos. All right, in Photoshop, you can see I have this photo as an example and I'm gonna apply a Channel Mixer to this photo. So let's go down here and apply Channel Mixer. Here we have red, green, and blue because every color on your screen is made out of three colors, red, green, and blue. Here we have an output channel and what we're gonna do here is we're gonna select one of these colors. Let's go for red. And here you see these sliders. When I select red and I move the red slider up, I'm adding red to my red tones. When I'm selecting red for the output channel and I slide the green, I'm adding green to my red tones. And the same goes for the blue. I'm adding blue to my red tones. When we move the sliders to the left, we subtract the color from that one. Now let's use it on this photo. So I'm gonna select green because we see a lot of green in this photo. I wanna change that. So first what we're gonna do is we're gonna remove some green from the green tones and you can already see the difference here. And with a constant slider, we can subtract green from all the colors. Now let's go to blue and change those. Let's add a little touch of red to our blue tones. Let's also add a little bit of green to our blue tones. And let's remove some blue from the blue tones. And here you have a button, you can reset the settings if you want to. Let's close this for now and let's look at the difference. This was before and this is after. We fixed all those colors with the channel mixer. So that's pretty much it for the channel mixer. It's really useful for your photos to kind of correct every color. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and catch you on the next one.